Wir sach Milan bis Mail. Oh, great and serene Bismarck. What la is he speaking Fey right now? I wish that they said like which language he's speaking. I think he's speaking Fey. Man, a horny whale. It's like me playing Genshin Impact. Oh dear. I don't need to speak Fey to know that didn't go well. Good one, Alize. What will you say? I know what to do. We need Fey Ul. Yes, we need Fey Ul! My branch! I am your Sinek! I require your suckers! Me yet! You've learned to call me at last! And where do you go? On a trip? A journey? I knew you wouldn't give up without a fight. Oh, my precious mortal, I shall help you in any way I can! Why did she make me so happy? Guess Bismail win picked. Van Dromi Drom Jakob. Van Rea You're under my control now, Bismarck, you old sleepy bitch. What a rare thing to awaken to. My beautiful king, if it be thy they thy wish, when so shall it be done? Be sure to scrub this one's teeth for him upon your return. It's only good manners. It will be done, your majesty. Our deepest thanks for your timely intervention. An agreement is reached and your departure is at hand. You wingless ones best hold on tight. Wait, the, we're actually flying the whale to the next May zone? The blessings of the Fae keep you safe, Inba. No, no the Western Sea we go, wrapped up in my breath. I will see to your destination, little neighbors. Gaboon! Or Laboon! I just mixed Laboon and Gabu. And made them one. The boon. I, I I actually made Laboon and Gabu fusion. Think about how sick that would be. What are you, Bismarck? I'm actually confused by what this Bismarck is. Cause they said that. They said that uh, he's a fae. But why is this fae the primal that was summoned by the Vanu Vanu? I want to get more into and the lore like of it. just like that, it's all gone back to the way it was. What was you expecting? Hundred years of honey and rainbows? Seeing them Yulmore types wake up and smell the ashes was miracle enough for me. Magic in the air when that ladder started moving. <laughs> and when that great hulking Talos rose up. Gods. Why are you listening to these two guys? Who the fuck are these two? I could live a thousand years and never behold anything so amazing. What the? Do you see that? That's us. What a monster! Where did it even come from? It's a storm out! Quick, let us have it! It's not stopping! Run! Run! How many people did we kill just to go on a vacation? 
May you be rejoined. Wait. Dude, I have a feeling Final the people who wrote Final Fantasy just watched One Piece and then remade it. This is Fishman Island. Where's the Fishman steroid drugs? The Fishman Island arc. Wow. One piece, but good. The breath of Bismarck. See how it swells to form a dome beneath the waves? The waters recede. The Tempest's floor is laid bare. Water's like my hairline. In defiance of the blinding sky, this place holds fast to its gloom. The last refuge of he who denies the light with every fiber of his being. You stand at the precipice, hero. Journey unto the heart of darkness. Finish it. Under the sea. They came. The finless one. They followed me. Why have you come? Was it you? Uh, was it you who took away our water? Dude, Thanker just always instantly is just like, yo, what up? Ah, so this is where Ando make their home. I had wondered. Pray, forgive us any incentive uh, or any inconvenience that we have caused. We were not aware your people lived here in the Tempest. Dude, Alfie is such the diplomat. We fucking love Alfie. We need this great dome of air that we might conduct a most urgent search and thus beg for your understanding. <laughs> what are these guys actually called? These Oh, they're called Ando? What were they called in the source? Sahagin. Ah, oh, yes, that's right. Are you emissaries of the Ancient Ones? If you are the emissaries, the chosen, I bid you welcome. If you are not, I bid you leave. <laughs> Svea broke summit, man. Svea broke summit. The Andu want to honor the coming of these ancients. So their answer in light got ablaze with the, the right kind of brightness. Like, like the spark of life caught in a crystal. But just being sparkly is not enough. It's got to dance with joy and sorrow and a sense of hardship and dirt. You know what I mean? No, dude, you're fucking scaring me. <laughs> your thoughts turn to Renderay and the crystal you discovered at the end of your journey. Maybe Geralt can find inspiration in that. Whoa! Do all of the job quests give you a? Uh, do all of the job quests give you a stone? So they all end in a stone, and that's how they get- Wow. The gate actually makes narrative sense. Another example of ludic narrative harmony. These guys are fucking geniuses. It's so crazy how people who make games usually don't think that much about a detail like that. I've let the Ando down, eh? But more than I've let myself down. Might as well go back to mending kettles. Look at this stone. Show him the crystal which once belonged to Ardbart's companions. To one of Ardbart's companions. Oh, every roll quest is a different... Holy shit, that's fucking beautiful. It's fucking beautiful. Such strike and beauty. It shines with heartache and laughter and the transience of life. Like the turmoil... A history made manifest. Dude, this is such a fucking beautiful moment. A, I can see the brilliance of the crystal's legacy. Ah, ye'd never capture such a gleam. Not if ye labored a hundred years.
Ah, and done. Dude, he fixed my camera. What a good craftsman. I've taken the wonders of the crystal showed me and channeled them into a new scape that benefits the Andu spiritual successor. Whoa. I haven't seen trees that crazy since college. Not a bad job if I say so myself. Hey, those are some pretty cool branches and trust me, I know, my branch is the Titiana. And to think, I was this close to hanging up me hammer after studying the craft of them ancients. Wow, he was actually depressed because he was like, I'll never make anything that good. It's like watching a Chicken Nito play guitar. Just being like, why? I'll stay here and dream up a new ar armaments for you to try. Oh shit. This does this guy give the relic gear? Does this guy give the relic here? You now have access to his forge. Rewards become... Oh, shit, dude. Wait, that doesn't look that good. That looks fucking awesome. Wait, I just get all of this for free? Free drip! Wait, that's actually drippy as fuck! Tiny little cowboy? Free for every class, so you, you just get to 80 and then you just go to him and then you just get your class gear. That's cool as fuck. Man, I'm literally thinking about the new summoner right now, and I'm curious if I'm going to like it or not. That That's actually what I'm thinking about right now, like kind of in my head. I kind of like... I was thinking about how the Phoenix Trance is probably the oh, best feeling part. Stewards of the Ondo, we offer up our light in answer. That crystal you showed the artisan. Nom noms are Jujutsu Kaisen. Dude! Underwater ghost! Davy Jones. Was it. Did it belong to one of my friends? Yeah, the cat bitch that shot my friend. And she was a, she was a real jerk about it. And I'm still mad at her. Even though we saw that she was a sad cat girl. I do not forgive you hurt for hurting Alizé. I do not forgive you. Alizé is one of my best friends. B word? I can I can say bitch. You're a bitch. You're a bitch if you think I can't say bitch. I thought you were always watching. <laughs> they did it I again. Give you a measure of privacy. No one wants a spirit looking over their shoulder every moment of the day. Honestly, why do you give me privacy when I'm out questing, but not when I'm back in my bedroom, Ardvart? You kind of treat me like I'm just a hookup, and not your. Never mind. So tell me, if you would, how did you come across that crystal? It was Render raised then. Yeah. You looked good when you were young, man. What happened? It's strange that I should learn such things now, after they're long gone. They were fine friends, every one of them. You were too. Their their party was pretty sick. Teach me so much. Honestly, their party was just as sick as our party. You know. About death. I'm a fan. About Seto. About you. About the hope that hides at the heart of this world. You know what's fucked up? We don't have a Seto. Oh no, our Chocobo is I've our never Seto. Been one for idle chit chat. We just can't talk. Some miracle, I could see them all again. I doubt I'd ever stop talking. Huh? I'm grateful I got to bend your ear, at least. And just for that, I reckon I'll stick with you. To the very end. Dude, Ardbart, I hate that you have to suffer an unending, eternal purgatory. But it does make my life a little bit better. Fist bump? Can we do the fist bump thing? Where we glow? Apologies, we were a little late to the gathering. What's up, Alfie? Wow, that the juxtaposition in gaining their trust. That juxtaposition where he's talking about his his party and all of his uh all the, the, the people that he had, and then you see our whole crew roll up. 
Makes you appreciate what you have. Very well done. The delay wasn't exactly welcome, but at least our many hands made light work. And they seemed especially impressed with your contribution. Our hero indeed. Thank you, Chad Crit. Yustola was telling us those structures may date back to the age of the Asians. Yeah, I think they're Asian uh, mansions, An maybe. Asian homeland. Yeah, good neighborhood too. I, I, I mean, I'm pretty sure that these these Asian houses probably went for at least three mil. Despite his many protestations, I never quite believed Emmett Selk was telling the truth. Nor I. But there is no denying the evidence before our eyes. Clearly, this was once a great city. A home they would see restored, no matter how many tens of thousands of years it takes. Can't blame him. It's a hollow dream when you think about it. Even if they manage to rejoin all the worlds, they'll never bring back the ones who were lost. But would I have done any different? No, we're actually doing the same exact thing. Like, that is the beautiful part. We are doing the same exact thing. We are fighting to save home. The difference, though, is we aren't necessarily creating a mass genocide to do it. But if we had to, we probably would. Are you... How are you feeling? You're right. Thank you. That feels really nice because usually people just spam, that's genocide, that's Rich Campbell. You're wrong? No, 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 I'm not. You're wrong. How are you feeling? About to explode. <laughs> you have completed your devotions? Yes. To the honored ancients have we offered up our prayers and our gratitude. You too have our thanks. Might we trouble thee then to tell us more of the illuminated land of which thou didst lately speak? Illuminated land? That's my bedroom at 5 p.m. To the west of here lies a great land. trench. Some days ago, a light appeared in that endless darkness. I am convinced you are the sign for which we have been waiting. My people will show you the way. Shall we? Yes, we shall. Let's go on a journey. This is... This is... Uh, this zone is piquing my interest in so many different ways. By the gods... It's going to be Graha on the couch watching Friends. What the fuck? It's York's new city. Oh my god, it's why I like the rejoining so much, man. Because it's just the, it's the New York when mentality. Spoke of a city. I did not think they meant an actual city. I was just like, yeah, 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 of course. Why the fuck not? Rapture? True. Then we are seeing the same view. The remnants in the Ondo settlement were solid material structures. But these. Are they made out of ether? Everything here pulses with ether. Tis an enchantment on a monumental scale.
Holy shit. Holy shit. Rich, did you note the style of the architecture? It's fucking badass, and anybody who gets to live in this city would probably be really cool and really badass. Tis the same used for the remnants of the cuffs of the mural painted of the tower. Look closely. Emmett Selk has not simply reclaimed these ruins. He has layered the semblance of an entire city upon them. Gods, the magnitude of the art... I can't believe that Emmett Selk was in New Yorker the whole time. The magnitude of the artifice is staggering. Though it pains me to admit, we did not fully understand the feats of which the old world Asians are capable. Look at the size of these doors. Now I know how pixies must feel. Shut up, Alfie. You're small as fuck, Alfie. This is a Mizkif door. Rich Campbell recognized. Welcome to the city of Amarut. Will you be riding the lift? Hey, yeah, I'm fucking lifting here. What? Did the building just welcome you? My city. My city. Mayhaps it's not so passing strange. Did Emmett Selk not invite Rich to visit his abode? Tis plain thy coming was expected. I'm seven times rejoined. I was probably a pretty cool ass again. I will ride the lift. I love New York. Next stop, ground floor. Facilities include the Bureau of the Administration, the Bureau of the Architect, and the Capitol. Didn't notice the NPCs. I didn't see any NPCs. It's only the distance that you start to realize how big the buildings truly are. It's only at this distance that you really start to realize how truly big the, business, uh, the buildings are. What did the voice call the city? Amarut? Look over there. Is that a person? Ah, oh, no, my mistake. That's a giant. It doesn't seem to have noticed this yet. Giant or no, the residents of this place have much and more to tell us. I say we make the first move. Alfie! You can't just... They'll ah! be okay, I'll say. Dude, what the fuck is that? Pray, excuse my baldness, but might I ask you a few questions? What is this thing? Kind of reminds me of one of the, the guys from... Uh... The fuck? Oh, what, an ado what adorable costumes. Are you children of the excursion? This district has much to teach you. How odd. That sounded like no language I've ever heard, and yet I understood every word. Just as he understood us. Universal translator. Uh huh. And which district is this exactly? This this must be lost poor things. You must be lost poor things. You stand in the the poly literate district. Man, they're poly literate here. I'd be fine with being literate in just one language. Where lie the institutions most vital to the management of our star? Is this New York City? Yes, how'd you recognize it? Welcome to my city. Hey, where's the fucking bodega? Can you tell us where, uh, tell us where to find Emmett Selk? Can you tell us who rules this city? Yeah, who rules this city? I know the mayor. He's an asshole. Who rules? What a curious question. Perhaps you refer to our super visiting body? Our supervising body, rather? The Convocation of 14? 
So Emmett Selk isn't the leader here. Emmett Selk is a member of the convocation. Were you hoping to witness its deeds firsthand? Take me to Emmett. Hmm, hardly surprising, I suppose. The whole world holds its breath as the final days draw near, and our brightest minds race to implement their plans. Oh, God. This cult's more efficient than my cult. OTK. Thus, you must understand that gaining an audience at this time will be next to impossible. You should hurry home. It's talking to me like I'm some small child. You should hurry home now before your families begin to worry. Do you need me to walk you back? No, thank you. We'll be fine. Teach you. Well, take care, little ones. How old is this thing? I guess we kind of are kids to it, right? Not just size-wise. Guys, it's not about size. If that thing's like 100 and we're 20, we're kids to it, you know? Emmett Selk hath returned a memory, a moment of time from before the star was sundered. Wow. We're in Assian, New York. So, we find ourselves in a long distant destroyed in, uh, inhabited by long departed. An unusual situation, to be sure. But at least we're able to parlay with these ancients. In fact, they seem downright eager to chat. I say we use this to our advantage. Split up, strike up some conversations, and see if we can't learn location of our quarry. Holy fucking shit. And while we're at it, it wouldn't hurt to wheedle out a few more details regarding the convocation of the 14 and their impending disaster. Good gracious, child. Where is your family? You should not be all alone at a time like this. Run along quickly now. Have you not heard? Though yet confined to the lands across the sea, a terrible phenomenon flicks our star. They are calling it the final days. Oh shit! I wasn't thinking clearly when I talked when the first one talked to us, and I was like, oh, because you don't. I, I didn't realize it was a reflection of the past or whatever the, the fuck this is. And I was like, oh, the final days. I thought that he was talking about, you know, like, with being in the first right now, that this realm was going to end because of the, cal the calamity and light. But it's the final days. Are we actually going to see Zodriark get summoned right now? Holy shit. Fuck, man. This is truly fucking crazy. The story's really fucking coming together. Crazy theory. Guys, spam Lala Jams right now. The only title that was previously mentioned by M itself. We now heard two titles. One started with an M. The other one was Low Griff. A while ago. I think I'm the Low Griff, dude. I'm Low Griff. I am the Sundered Low Griff, man. Um, I saw, I saw, I linked the chat for just one second and I saw, I'm the low grip Keck W. I'm the low grip Copium. Uh, much spookier when they're, they're Amaranths and not Lollafels. Here we go, finally. Oh, wait, this isn't our plot device kicking in. This is the light energy that's inside of us killing us. You, I think, are from a time beyond ours. Yo, you're a five-headed Amaranth. I always so I always said Amaranth most five-headed streamer on Twitch. You, I think you're from a time beyond ours. Have you followed the wake of Emmett Selk? Nay, there is no cause for alarm. I am simply a shade. Here and not here. Trust me, dude. I'm that's that's great. I'm really good at dealing with shade. I get it all the time in Twitch chat. We're gonna get along just fine, man. 
I know only my name is Helodius, and that this city is a recreation, a phantom movement, plucked from the well of history. It's Hith, Hith Lo Deus, Hith. It's Lodius, it's Lo Deus. These others seem unaware of their pale existence, but I wonder if Emmett Selk's mind was distracted when it came to my re uh, reconstitution. This is how I feel every day. A stray thought would have been enough. Hithlodius will realize the truth, for example. We were close friends once, you see. Yet in spite of my perception, I play the same role as the rest. A bit, a bit part meant to bring color and noise to this well-crafted stage. Too much scrutiny, and we shall burst like the fragile bubbles we are. Dude, Hithlodius is like... Pagliacci. Thus, I tell you again, my presence is not to concern you. I wish only to share your company whilst we wait. If you've come this far, then you know of the catastrophe which awaits us on our morrow. The final days. What began as an isolated incident soon swelled into a world-spanning threat. The convocation of the 14, well, it was the 13 at the time, endeavored to create a will for our star. They would repair the fundamental laws of order that halt uh, and halt the spread of destruction. But creation on such a scale requires an immense source of power. Of those of us who still lived, only half offered up their lives in the name of salvation. Holy shit, they've been doing genocide for a millennia. And from their sacrifice, Zodriarch was born. Just as we had hoped, he reached forth and halted the March of Oblivion. Yet, oh how the star had suffered. So many species lost. The land was blighted. The waters poisoned. And even the wind had ceased to blow. Guys, thank you for all these primes. They literally had the to, to, to human transmutation, philosopher's stone, the amaranths to form Zodriarc. Once more did the people, once more did our people give of themselves to Zodriarc. Another half of our race sacrificed to, to, uh, to cleanse the world. Holy fucking metal. To ensure that the trees and grasses and a myriad of tiny lives would sprout and grow and flourish. So half to make Zodriarch, half of the half for Zodriarch. The cycle of life had begun anew, and we reconsidered the means by which we might protect it. The Convocation decided thus, we would nurture our world until it was bursting with vitality. 
Then when the time was right, we would offer some portion of, a li- of its living energy to Zodriark. Wait, so now they're fucking farming life just to sacrifice it to Zodriark. In return, he would restore to us those brethren whose souls we had fed his strength. They're trying to bring back their loved ones by creating other life to kill, to bring back their loved ones. It's just a vicious cycle of genocide. Remember when we saw a primal bring back loved ones before? Meat puppets? I, honestly, when, when the snake people, when that primal brought back the other life, Edward and Alphonse did a better job of bringing back their mother than that primal did. his strength and together we will resume our role as stewards there were however those who disagreed with this plan they argued that enough had been sacrificed to Zodriar and this new world should belong to the lives to lives newly born these dissidents sundered their life energies in the creation of Hydaelyn an incarnation of their opposing belief. And for the first time in history, our people stood divided. Know you then how the conflict ended. Hmm, I thought you might. Surrendered? I surrendered to no one. I'm sorry, they don't teach us the word surrender in America. Looks like we have a lot of French viewers today. I believe the word was sundered. Emmett Selk has ever been a champion of the will of Zodriark. He's he's tempered as fuck. The original plan may have been set back by millennia, but he will not abandon his course. He will pay the price of our return by whatever means necessary. And though he may carry himself with certain, uh, certain glib ease, Emmett Selk is not a man to bear his burdens lightly. In fact, I imagine they have only grown heavier with every passing century. Tis truly terrible. It's a truly terrible weight which he has to carry. Basically, everybody he knew died, and he's tempered by a primal which he summoned. He's having a bad century. Rich Campbell. It seems your turn has come. Pray, do not let me keep you. Man, I'm not gonna lie. Playing in Lalafell really does fuck with the immersion sometimes. They actually had that motherfucker stand up on the bench after one of the saddest cutscenes in the game. They had the motherfucker stand up on the bench and full on jump and Spider Man land on the ground. Holy fuck. That really changed the mood. Ah, there's one last thing. You wait with another at your side, yes? Wait, you walk with another. At your side. How the fuck does he know about Hardbart? (laughs) 
Nay, I see no uh, definite form. Just the faintest suggestion of a second soul. I doubt it's visible to anyone but me. Otherwise, I assume only you can see and hear his ethereal companion. <laughs> Was that a laugh? Like, like a chuckle? Like a... <laughs> Or is it like a hmm, hmm, hmm? Yeah, it was a chuckle. Okay. It looked like it was a chuckle. I just want to make sure. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Your connection is hardly a coincidence in our time. The two of you were one. The color of your souls tells the tale. Do you think it's better for him to be stuck in this purgatory or should we get eight times rejoined? Like, I kind of feel like we should, we should like meld. I'm not saying I want the rejoining to happen, but I just think that Aardvart and I, I should like kind of fuse up, kind of fuse on. Maybe we can. I, I don't know. The, the thing with Aardvart is like, I would love him to be my ethereal companion forever. I fucking love the dude, but he can't fucking touch anything or eat anything. It actually reminds me of Alphonse, but even worse. Remember how Alphonse has to stay up at night when everybody else sleeps and just has to think about everything that he's lost? And he's just alone at night? And he just watches other people eat pie, and he goes, One day I'll eat pie! It's like that, but actually fucking worse for Aardbart. It makes a lot of sense. At one point, I said, I wonder if Aardbart is us in the first... I, I guess Aardbart and I are both the Logriff, maybe. All right, let's keep going. Holy fucking shit. It makes sense why other people can't see him, though. I am distinctive. Are, are you that distinctive? Cannot be mistaken. No matter how thin the soul is spread. Oh my god! Heidelin, you saucy motherfucker. That's why Heidelin slash Minfilia doesn't want him to be gone. She potentially wants us to be rejoined. To be stronger for her. That's the only reason to keep him alive. Because that was the thing. I was like, then why would she... The only reason that she would want to potentially keep him alive is to rejoin us to make us her most powerful warrior. I see that my camera turned off. This makes a lot of sense why only we can see him. And he, he totally can't see him for a little while. I don't know the reason that Hithlodius can actually see it. Yo, Van, thank you for that. Ha! Ah, this is just the kind of fate I might expect for one such as he. Surely Emmett Selk has recognized the hint of him and you. Very well. My new old friend, may you find what it is you seek. I'm pretty sure I'm like Emmett's best friend. Like, I'm pretty sure like I'm one of Emmett's best friends. Oh my god, what if I'm what if I'm his lover? Yeah, I'm pretty- I'm pretty sure that I'm, like, one of Emmett's best fucking friends. Or, like, his son or some shit. And it's just torture to watch me. <laughs> what?! A great sacrifice of life in exchange for their brother's resurrection? And you say all Asian scheming has been leading to this? All this time. But if they still mean to enact this plan, then things won't end with the rejoining. A. And I thought we knew their intentions in full. Restore the world to its former glory. 
Okay, the rejoining is a fucking bad idea. Here we go. It's so fucking hot in here. How hot is it in here? It's only 77 degrees. It's not that bad. I'm just worried about the camera. Shadowbringers. Holy fucking shit. We're actually fucking here. When Minfilia entrusted me with her power, she warned me that no matter how strong you become, you can still fall victim to despair. You can still feel powerless. And she was right. After you collapsed on Mount Golg, my hands wouldn't stop shaking. If I made a mistake, if I failed to bind the light within you, I was terrified you would die. Even now, you could be moments from turning, and I wouldn't know how to save you. You thankred the others you've all been there when I needed help. Minfilia surrendered her life to me, her legacy. I should be ready to do the same for you. And I want to, I do, but I, I just, I'm not good enough. Oh, Reen, come on. I thought you left like this imposter syndrome shit back when you were in Minfilia. Reen, you're fine. You're, you're a certified badass. You're a good fighter. You're a nice human being. You make me laugh. You've never made me laugh. But you're my friend. She told me to follow your example, and I've tried. I've really tried. Stop. Oh, God. Rain's doing her best impression of what we're all going to be doing as we get a little bit further in this quest, I have a feeling. Then you shouldn't hang your head. I'm not asking to be saved. Then you shouldn't hang your head. I shouldn't? No. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fate can be cruel, but a smile better suits a hero. I'm... I'm not sure I... Actually, never mind. I think I'll understand better if I try myself. You can go your own way. Read from destiny of being just Minfilia. Reen, walk, walk forward. No, nothing will come of brooding here my self-pity. I've made my decision. Rich, I'm going with you. That's a hero right there. That is a hero. That is a hero. That is a hero. Okay, what's going to happen? I'm nervous as shit. I actually feel kind of sick to my stomach right now. Like, I've never... I Like, I, I, I'm not even kidding. I feel fucking sick to my stomach. I've never felt like... Like... You could put me, if I'm doing like a Dota show, World of Warcraft show, any stuff like that, you could put me in front of a crowd of 10,000 people. You could literally put me at TI in front of thousands of people, millions of people. And I would, nothing, you know, hands steady. And right now, I am nervous. Welcome to the capital. All visitors must present an official writ of permission before admittance will be granted. Your documents appear to be in order. You may proceed into the capital, but any guest, any guest you may choose to bring with you 
must remain in your vicinity at all times. I wish it had everybody this who's lined up in the cutscene. is unacceptable. I gave you very specific instructions. Oh yeah, he told us to come alone. Well, we don't roll that way, Emmett. Emmett Selk. We may be sundered, but we roll as a unit, and we're stronger together. My invitation was for an abomination, ripe with the power to bring about the world's annihilation. Not this half-broken... thing. Whatever am I to do with you? Fuck you. And I see you insist on keeping the same familiar company. Are you so lost without them? It is not he who is lost without the familiar. You tell him he's Tola? Claws out. Not content with remaking an entire city. You aim to fill it with the reconstituted souls of the dead. True! Yeah, yeah, he's Tola. He insulted us. Get him while he's down. Like, yeah, you don't even have any friends. You just gotta summon shades of your old friends. She rolled him. I may have gotten a little carried away in my attention to detail. Added a few unnecessary flourishes. <laughs> Emmett always wins. Doesn't matter how hard you roll, he always wins. Well, there's no point trying to hide it. Yes. Once the rejoining of worlds is complete, Zodiac will regain his full strength and shatter his prison. Then we shall offer up the source's remaining inhabitants in sacrifice, that we might resurrect our brethren who died to bring Zodiac into existence. Imagine being like, yo, so I'm leading a mass genocide. What's the point to your genocide? Well, the point of my genocide is to start another genocide. It's literally genocide just to start the genocide. He's pre-gaming genocide. I, I I still like the guy. Pyramid scheme? <laughs> but what was it that you came here to do exactly? Stop you? <laughs> I don't know. Guess. Take a wild guess. Go fish, Emmett's own. Probably stop you from killing everybody we know. <laughs> hey, we came to stop you. We're here for the excerpt. We, we came to stop you. Yeah, we're going to go with that one. <laughs> Did you know? One last do or die attempt to foil my plans before your mind dissolves into madness. I'm not even going crazy, man. How very, very heroic of you. Okay, sassy. Okay, sassy Samuel. Sassy Selk. In every single age, there is always someone who wants to stand up to the evil Asians. Always the same arrogance, the same insistence that the world belongs to them, as if theirs were the only rightful claim, theirs the only existence worthy of preservation. Even now, after everything, you refuse to see reason. Your friends chose to die to bring out Zodriar. My friends don't even know how to say his name. You think it unfair that you were subject to suffering? That your lives will be sacrificed for the ancients? Look at me. I have lived a thousand, thousand of your lives. 
real voice. I have broken bread with you. Fought with you, grown ill, grown old, sired children, and yes, welcomed death's sweet embrace. For eons have I measured your worth and found you wanting. Too weak and feeble-minded to serve as stewards of any star. Have your recent spats with Vorthri and his Sin Eaters taught you nothing? Tell me that for all this ego you have, your plans don't usually pan out the way you planned, pal. Have you not learned that your ignorance and frailty beget only endless misery? How long do you mean to perpetuate this farce? How much more must I endure your bumbling interference? Okay, yes, it ha it worked seven times, all right? But it's not working this time. Eight times the charm, am I right, heroes? Eight times the charm. Let us imagine that the laws of reality are again undone and the world faces true annihilation. Do you honestly believe that half your number would sacrifice themselves to save the other? N Omega Lol. Let of it burn. Of course they wouldn't. Yeah. We're the good guys. We're the heroes, so they don't have to be. And if you had witnessed history unfold as I had, you would reach the same conclusion. Alfie's like, even Alfie's like, fuck, I can't downvote this one. I gotta farm karma somewhere else. You cannot be entrusted with our legacy. I will bring back our brethren, our friends, our loved ones. The world belongs to us and us alone. I feel like you can't even bring back your loved ones, brother. I, I feel like you actually can't. If you weren't trying to do that part, I was kind of on board. Look, I was kind of on board. I'm a sick fuck, man. I want to make the world a better place. I agree with a lot of the things you said, but man. You're making it hard. Guys, I, look, I don't stand with the genocide anymore. I don't. But you gotta admit, it's not black, it's not it's not black and white. Like, it, this is a complicated situation, for sure. Emmett Selk! Okay, Alfie, let's see what you got. We understand, truly, but it makes no difference. The ones you love are in the past, while ours are here in the present. Yep. One day, we too will be ashes and dust, but not today. Our time is not yet finished. Upvote that, chat. Upvote that. We share your conviction, and that is why we will not abandon our course. You think us the same? You think your tattered soul of equal worth to those I lost? Then come. Earn your place. Prove yourselves worthy to inherit this star. What? Why is it shaking?
What was the coming oblivion? Fuck, man, this is so good. A fitting backdrop for your final judgment. I shall wait within, but do not spend too much time on your preparations. There's no telling how much longer the guest of honor will last. So he has, he has Graha locked up in there? Holy shit. That might be the most badass thing that's happened in this fucking game. Into oblivion. They came. Amarut. A dungeon that actually shows us the very welcome to the final days of Amarut. We're literally seeing what fucking was so bad. We're gonna find out what was so bad that they had to summit Zodriark. Oh my god. I can't believe we're actually fucking here. We're actually here, boys. These are some chonky boys. Holy guacamole, this is a crazy dungeon. This is a crazy fucking dungeon. Holy shit. Just as prayer gives rise to pride, our dread may manifest our deepest fears. It just seems like it's the uh, it's got to just be like counterbalance like the other side of the coin it's just like if you're if you're gonna create so much this is the flip side of that right mechanics time I have to go this way otherwise my group's gonna die she, she kept she kept moving. I can survive this. Stop following me! Were they trying to kill me? They were close. They almost got me. This is a fucking cool. The land buckled, the cities burned, the waters ran red with blood. Dragon? They built dragons? Mech dragon? Holy shit. Holy shit. I'll be one second, guys. Wait, guys, I'll be one second. I'm getting my new wallpaper. Dude, all of these look like... Dude, that's like an Elzen Chimera. Dude, 
Dude, you know what this is starting to remind me of? Like Dragon Age Origins almost. It's like some like blood magic shit. Oh. Yet this is far from the worst of it. Come, and I will show you. So much better than a flashback. Just Emmett actually throwing us through a dungeon of his pain. Holy shit. Just a little further. And you will see the end of a world. Booba honey. Ah! Gotta get out of the AoE! I know that it's supposed to be like the end of a world and it's supposed to like not be beautiful and be like kind of sad, but I think it's gorgeous, man. The star was fading. We saw we had to weave its laws anew. Holy shit. Holy fuck. This is fucking gorgeous, man. Oh my god. Let's fuck this thing up. To the left, to the oh wait, all the way to the left. Oh whoa, nani nani nani. Wait, are we losing ground? Is there like an enrage timer? Death ray. Oh, death ray keeps ticking. That was for science. Nice stack. Nice bait, Grat. Nice bait. Nice bait. Yeah. Yeah. How are we going to handle the fall off damage now? Oh no, you can fall off the edge! Man, I didn't know you. It was an honest mistake. I ice skated off the edge, man. I I, I didn't even walk off the edge. I ice skated off the edge, man. Yeah, I ended five out with a limit break. BM as fuck. Your performance was underwhelming, and I remain unconvinced of your worthiness. Worthiness for what? Oh, you tower over your misbegotten ilk, no doubt. But should I bring my full strength to bear, well, you would be as leaves in the wind. Leaves in the wind? You don't even have wind on your home world anymore. Oh wait, you don't even have a home world. Get sundered. The gulf between us is a reflection of the disparity between the world as it was and what it has become. The gulf between us is a reflection of the disparity. But okay. Ah! Why? Alize, not now. 
You literally let a bard take you down. Our world may not live up to your lofty standards. Alize, you lost to a bard. Literally the only the like you lost to a bard, and you're gonna go down to toe with an ass and come on! Get it together! But they are our worlds, our homes, full of life and love and hope. You're right though. You are right. And we won't stand by and let you destroy them! Alize! She's fine. You he just pushed her. Are a mistake. And it reminds me of my dad. For we who have no perfection, the shattered source and these shards are ghastly mockeries of the true world. Holy shit, look at that. I'm sorry, I'm such- I'm fanboying so hard right now. This is fucking insane. I've never experienced something this good. The ephemeral lives you exalt are pale imitations, utterly devoid of meaning. <laughs> Wait, is she?! Little us all you like. Yeah, no, she's fine. But she's we fine. will she's rise fine. She's again fine. She's and again and give the lie to your insults through word and deed. We define our worth, not the circumstances of our creation. Based? <laughs> More prattle. They fell around him. They, they fell around him and the explosions went outward. No, no fucking shot. Fool. Who are you? No one. Nothing. There's no reason for him to kill them. They're not dead. He just said, if I wanted to kill you, Once I could have killed I have you. Reclaimed my heritage. My first act would be to expunge your stain from history's weave. History going out to the club on a Saturday? Why is it wearing a weave? My world will have no need for heroes. Is the light just breaking me down right now? Yeah, okay. It's like, why am I walking Still like Still fighting the good fight. Oh. Nice fucking astro protection there. Hell yeah, he stole it. Get his Jack White looking head it ass. It's true that all we hold dear is fated to fade away. But that is no reason for us to forsake it. To take what steps we may, and thus mark the road for those who would follow. That 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 was a really good one. Wait, that that's a really good one. That's a good line. I'm gonna I need that one. I might tweet that later. That that was a really good one. To strive for the best of all futures. Be this not also thy purpose? Strive for the best of all futures, be this. Good touche. What the fuck? Do not presume to speak of my future. And you, 
Why waste your final moments in futile defiance? Weary wanderer, you've no fight left to fight, no life left to live. You see, the light will not be denied. Surrender to your fate and let the transformation take you. Rise up in madness and fury. Devour the vermin infesting the land which is rightfully ours. I don't think I like Emmett as much as I thought I did. Chadfred! Now, Reed! Now! Is she gonna mend me? She's gonna stitch me back up. No, no, no. Do not fucking kill Reed. Fight it. You have to hold on. She's actually dead, huh? Oh, fuck, man. If you had the strength to take another step, could you do it? Dude. <laughs> oh. Could you save our worlds? No way. He's gonna fucking fuse with us, huh? And he's gonna fucking die in the process, man. This world is not yours to end. This is our future. Our story. Dude, Arbor just talked with my mouth! No, it can't be. Oh my god, he sees who we were before we were sundered! Because we're like eight times rejoined right now. Holy fucking shit! me alone we stand together wait that how I'm surprised you can stand at all Could not well read matters half finished. 
that expands contract, Eon become instant. What? From beyond the rift. Heed my call. What? 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 No shot! No fucking shot! Damn you! Damn you all! Proceed to your final judgment. The victor shall write the tale, and the vanquished become its villain. I'm tweeting that. I have nerd chills. This is the best thing that's ever happened to me in my entire fucking life. Holy shit! I am Hades. He who shall awaken our brethren from their dark slumber. Our brethren! Our brethren. He said our brethren. The dying gasp is now accessible. Holy shit. Use du duty finder. Okay, okay, okay. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dying grasp. Time to be a fucking legend. Holy shit. I have so many fucking emotions right now. I wonder if when at the end of this, if it tells us what our name is. Hades. Holy guacamole. Show your faulted strength and I shall expose the lie of your fragmented existence. I don't think that he might be a good guy anymore. It, it's hard to continue to think that he might be a good guy. All right. Look at that son of a bitch. How does darkness rain? Because I would like to not be hit by it. Okay, we did it. Flee, you fool. I think flee, you fools, means we should run. You are a wolf. Ah! Do we soak? Do we soak or run? Okay, nobody else is soaking. Oh, there, there's a stack! Fire. 
Okay, I feel like we have like a really big weird phase coming up right now. Use your shotgun. Which where's your chainsaw gun? 80s? I got bad news for you, partner. I am stifled by this vessel of flesh. Did he just stab himself with his weapon and shadow oozed out of him instead of blood? And now he's getting a new Okay, okay. Well played, Hades. Holy shit, look at this. Oh my god, it's assy and masks. I shall bear every hope, every dream, every prayer. He's like the Von Hohenheim of Assians. The future of this star shall be shaped by my hands. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit. What is this? Behold, a sorcerer of hell trembled before my glory. Oh, so he can swipe? Okay, we stand under his arm? I am about my perfect law! Up into the world of good! Secured! Holy shit. I'm stuck in a snow globe of death. Release me from baby jail, assy and fool. Fuck you, Hades. Fuck your whole couch. Another phase? Wow, it put us in like a perfect circle. Vain reflections. Must reclaim his vain reflections. Fuck with me, bitch! I don't care if you're an Asian. This is one of the most epic fucking experiences. Get it. You, you have no power over me. Dude, when he fucking just whipped out his Assian trench coat, just lined up, it's like the dude in Washington Square Park. You can tell that he's a real New Yorker from the city that he was in. He whipped up the trench coat like with all the fake Rolexes, but instead it was just Assian masks. Holy fucking shit. Now let's find up, find out what we just did. What the heck just happened? Nani? The fuck?
Man, this is like watching an XQC stream with TTS on. Oh my god. Dude, he's look. Yes! He's literally got a sunken cost fallacy, but with souls. Thank for What the fuck? No way! No way! He just cap danced on his wing, broke up the Pokeball into bits! Is this actually gonna work? Such infernal strength! Can we use like the light energy that we have to? You guys have been talking about it a lot. I'm pretty sure what they just did was the twinning. Not 100% sure. Use the light, use the light aether. Get it the fuck out of us. No, 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 no. Job change. Hard part time. Oh, my God. Remember. Remember us. Remember that we once lived. It's over. Emmett Selk is no more. More importantly, how do you fare? What dost thou see? For a second, I thought she was going to pull down an Athia mask. I was like, what the it's fuck? Either. It is... It is as it used to be. As a disciple of Zodiac, the Asian was the darkness to your light. I can but assume that when you set your strength against his, the light within you was spent. No, it's more than that. Under the strain of that incredible flood of ether, your soul had begun to break apart. Yet now it seems somehow restored. Ardbart. I tried to help you before the battle, but Emmett Selk stopped me. 
So, how did you... Exactly what did you... Can you tell us what happened? Remember him too. Ah, you badass motherfucker. You didn't even need to die. We did it, my man. Where to start? We did it. I believe I owe you all an apology. And you, most especially. It's good to see you awake. <laughs> well, it is good to be awake. Holy shit. For a second, I thought that he was crying like pain tears and he was just gonna fall down and die. Oh my god. I thought he was just gonna fall down and fucking die. I... Oh, thank god. They fucking outdid themselves, man. souls dove straight into the ocean over there, did they? Uh, all, all I could see from here was the whale, Master Chai. T'was surely Alphno and those friends of his. They did something heroic, mark my words. And Aardvark. You only look up there for proof of that. As you say, my love. They're sure to be back. Any moment now. Any moment. They are coming back, aren't they? <laughs> Couldn't bear the thought of... <laughs> On this day, we'll return. <laughs> there, there, dear. Everything will be all right. There, there, look, over there, over the beach. Wait, who was that us? How are we in there? Greetings! You all right? Welcome back! I didn't think we'd be swimming. The whole way back. Heavens. Heavens. Take me. Alphano! Oh, hells.
Wait, Alfie learned how to swim? Does he act he actually learned how to he learned how to swim now? Oh my god, the Alize picture is even funnier now. The the Alize picture is even funnier now. But shouldn't we look for him? He'll wash up sooner or later. For the oh, he... love of Alpha no! Get up, get up, get up. You just beat the ultimate Asian god. Welcome back, dear ones! Oh hey! My branch! And thus did salvation come to the first? The lamps of Amarot will fade along with Emmet Selk's enchantments, and the depths shall be as once they were. Wait, where's Uriange? Mount Gulg will one day fall, and the Talos below yield to wind and rain. This tale, too, will fade with time, passing into legend as the world heals and moves on. <laughs> Nevertheless, Wait, is just in the water. Wait, you guys couldn't see it on my camera. He's just face down in the bottom of the water. Everybody's just drowning. Oh my god. Everybody's just drowning. Beat the assy and lost a puddle. How do they manage to have a better end to each expansion? They just keep on fucking going. They just keep on fucking going. As ether obeys the cycle, as death and decay gives way to new life, He's still with us. The blood's no longer on his axe. So too he can finally rest. We share, inspire others to rise to greatness. For we who walk before may lead those who walk after. Your road goes ever on, as does your story, as does your legacy. Such is the hero's lot, to touch the lives of countless others. Excuse me, you're the warrior of darkness, aren't you? Wide-eyed boy. I thought it said little boy for a second. Hey, you want a picture? Where are you from, really? And how did you get to be so strong? Well, I ate my vegetables. Little boy's taller than you. I get it, I get it.
By your deeds has the blinding light been banished from these skies, and the Sin Eaters driven to retreat. Although our many hurts will be years in the memory, we did it. I have faith that this world and her people will one day be whole once more. With no rejoining in prospect, the Source need no longer fear the coming of an eighth umbral calamity. Yeah, I guess we did. And with that triumph, the future from which you came will no longer come to pass. Yet here you still stand. Also, how do we get, how do they all get home? So I do. I wonder if that other age continues onward somehow, cut adrift from time's flow. Or have I simply etched myself a place upon this new block of history? Oh, yeah, he didn't cease to exist. That's big. Either way, this is an unexpected development. As the summoner of your souls, my death was meant to release you back to your world. Oh, that was the part of the plan that he didn't tell us. When he died, everybody just gets a free one-way ticket back to Poundtown. I see. And, and actually, probably, would it just never have happened? Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Yet I am very much alive, and you are still stuck here in the first. I believe I speak for us all when I say that we are happy to postpone our return if it means your life is spared. We will seek out another way. Which Asians are still alive to even try to rejoin? I, I bet you... Besides, I never had any intention of rushing home. There are people here I still need to thank, and this means I might actually have time to do so. I wonder if a Lidibus ends up not even being the bad guy. Because people are saying a Lidibus. I wonder if... I'm not going to read chat for a second. Clear chat. I bet you the bad guy ends up being Hyland, man. I bet you Heidelin ends up being the bad guy. Yet we dare not neglect our comrades in the source. Mistress Tataru, to name but one, will be most anxious to know how things stand with us. I wonder if Endwalker, so, if we actually we kill Heidelin and Zodriark. Be sure and give a full report to our fellow Scions, would you? Oh, and we'd also appreciate any news you can bring us from back home. Then I see no reason to delay. I can open the path from here. I imagine we each have matters demanding our attention, so let this be a farewell for us all. Send word when you've resummoned our friend. Oh, and do try to ensure he arrives within the city next time. Of course. I shall strive for utmost accuracy. No strange forests or unplanned passengers, I promise. <laughs> oh, man. Throw wide the gates. Throw wide the gates. Dude, this is by far the sassiest expansion out of all of them. Like, even, even all of the fucking chat options are fucking sassy. I'm a little relieved, to be honest. I would have been terribly lonely if everyone had suddenly disappeared. That's reasonable. We're pretty much your family. But I understand that you have to go. Safe journey, warrior of darkness. I hope to see you again soon. Oof. Yo, thank you, Skippy. Dude, thank you for the 10 gifted subs, man. Just a Holy fucking shit. The thank portal. you. Then you can be on your way. When I was a boy, many long years ago, I yearned to stand tall as the heroes of Eld. 
but like a fool seeking to pluck the stars from the heavens, my every attempt to reprise their deeds fell short. And then one day, an all but forgotten dream from my youth stood before me in the flesh. A hero who looked at the horizon and beyond and saw I knew not what. All I knew was that I would give anything to stand at that hero's side. Would that it was so easy. Can't go home. The glory of the heavens was ever beyond the grasp of those who never thought to reach for it. But if I have gained anything from all of this, it is the courage to stretch out my hand. That might be the best line of the game. This is no time for sleeping. Saying that for every line? You said that 20 minutes ago? Yeah, but I hadn't heard that one yet, okay? Meanwhile, in the Imperial, Pal Imperial Palace in the Source. Bro, just wait, you haven't seen anything yet? I don't think we can, we, we can call this nothing. Oh, finally, we figure out what's going on over here. Yo, Akashi, thank you for three months. <laughs> Estinian, it's been a while, man. It's been a while. Huh. Man, that's the best line in the entire game, huh? huh? To the West Gate. I want to know what's happening there. There are a lot of Astinian fanboys who probably actually do think that that is the best line in the entire fucking game. <laughs> yeah, well, actually, what Astinian's trying to say with this sign, with that one stretch of air, he showed that he truly is a man who is yet stoic and emotional. A man who can flee the whole world. Same as the others, struck down with a single blow. An unfortunate day to draw guard duty. Forgive me. These were your people. We took advantage of this slaughter to slip into the palace. It is not for me to grieve them. That was the Emperor. Wait! Ugh. Your radiance! Whoa, he still would. I didn't even really think about that. Yeah, I didn't really think about that. Wait, a Lidibus killed him. Gaius, you've missed your part in this, I'm afraid. Wait, it's question mark, question mark, question mark. Is it a Lidibus or did Xenos get back into his body? Identify yourself, demon. You were hoping for the Asian. Oh, no, Sean, 
motherfucking dirty fucking dog. That dirty fucking dog. He managed to get back into his fucking body. That dirty sly dog. That sly, smooth, operating, juicy ass combat sexual sociopathic freak. That weeb who won't stop collecting swords. The craven shed this skin and fled rather than face me. Eat pubes. <laughs> <A pity. laughs> Fucking I forgot. I was looking forward to crossing blades with my son. I forgot about that. How did you guys remember? But I cannot deny the feeling of satisfaction. Dude, if Zenos is still alive, I'll, I'll like literally eat pubes. Okay. Uh, good job with that clip. Good, really good job with that clip. Where did you, where did you have that clip saved to instantly be able to pull it up and drop it in chat? I'm just curious. I'm just curious. Cause I need to delete that. <laughs> I need to make sure you don't have that anymore. <laughs> Body and soul reunited at last. What now? The game continues, but the pieces have changed. Only if we trust in a paragon's words. A mistake I do not intend to repeat. He speaks the truth. How many... Th Dude, this is like the battle of the Chads. Elidibus is gone. Tore a hole into the rift. <sighs> Xenos. My foolish, greedy son. Was a second life not enough? What's the Empire too rich a prize to ignore? Is that why? Why did he, why did he even want that? True freedom for our nation, our people, will never be won by a spoiled princeling. The burden of this throne is beyond you. Hmm. Tis you, father, who have struggled with this burden. Simply holding the Empire together has occupied your limited faculties. Why is he so fucking hot, man? Shut up, Dad. It's not just a phase. I'll live as many lives as I want. <laughs> but you may take comfort in knowing that I have no intention of pursuing your tedious agenda. Nor am I interested in ruling over the Empire's lands. What do you want? No comfort and no intention of pursuing your TD agencies, nor am I interested in ruling over the Empire's lands. Why'd you kill him then? I came only to remove that which ruins my sport. I will not have my prey stolen by your petty wars and cowardly weapons. He did it just to fight us, his best friend? He doesn't want the fucking poison. He literally de killed him for me. He's like, stop with that bullshit fucking poison. I want to kill my best friend. Okay. I guess that's a pretty good reason. Even though his dad didn't really even want to do Black Rose, that was kind of the ass he kill me just for that. I would kill you. Yeah, he's literally saying, I, would, I'm, I want to kill you just to kill somebody else. It's kind of like... How Emmett wanted to do a genocide just, just to genocide everybody else. I need no other reason. Any and all who interfere with my hunt. That's my kill! Will not do so twice! 
just Mangeko Sharingan is dad. I heard the Asians speak of Zodiac, an idolin. Even the will of this star is but a construct of our own making. Ego face, man. We shall gorge upon their strength, and then, my friend, our contest shall begin anew. Dude. I know streamers, and this is a pretty large ego phase, man. This is a bigger ego phase than I usually see. Xenos! <laughs> it's not the biggest I've ever seen, but it's pretty big. Wait, what? That's how they end that? Oh my god, look! To be continued. We're, we teleported back to where it started. That's a bad bit. That's a bad bit. Wait, what the fuck? Look at this, man. Nothing missed. Hey, man, get back inside me. Get back inside me, dude. Get back inside me, man. Look at all these incredible people, man. Thank you all for making my experience so fucking incredible every single fucking day. Every single fucking day. I want up! I want up! I want up! Tataru. Is this the start of 6.1 or is this the end? This is the end. This is the real end. But, 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 Rich, is it really you? Sorry, I should not give that voice to Tatar. This is the end of 5.0. But how? When? We didn't think you'd be back for ages. Time moves in mysterious ways. Would you rather I won again? Time moves in mysterious ways. We don't need to hit her with sass right after we get out of fucking wormhole, okay? Tatar is taller than him. Okay, yeah. So, what's your point? Right. So it does. The reports you had delivered by the excitable little pixie said as much. Taltaru? <laughs> yeah, true. As for the situation on the side, the Imperials are still eyeing our forces from afar. From what I'm told, the Garlean armies have been slow to react and seem, some, uh, seem reluctant to commit to any large-scale engagements. It's an odd sort of stalemate. Otherwise, we've yet to see any sign of that awful Black Rose weapon we warned you about. It's crazy, like, how deep we were in the story before we just randomly got ripped out of our bodies. Like, if we didn't get ripped out of our bodies and sent to that last expansion, there was still so much going on. Same shirt. I like Drippy, man. What are you talking about? Still smaller IRL. Still banned in stream. Otherwise, we've yet to see any of that awful Black Rose weapon we were warned about. Oh, but I suppose we did call an old friend to help out on that count. Hee <laughs> hee. Kryl and I had a terrible time tracking him down. Though it will be worth to see the look on your face when you find out who it is. Anyway, I was just about to make contact with that helper of ours and then confirm the latest news from the front. Might you fancy having a rest while I do? Sounds good. Ah, the Warrior of Light. Back where he belongs. Just call me the Warrior of Darkness now, okay? Please. Just as if nothing had happened. Though you do seem different somehow. Yeah, I kind of got rejoined for an eighth time. You'll have to tell me all about your adventures when we next have a spare moment until then welcome back wind up graha
What? We're back on the moon? That Asian is from the moon. Why are we on the moon? Why do you hang out on the moon, Olidibus? It is metal as fuck, but literally, why? Why are we here? Why are we fucking here? Why are we in this fake studio in LA? No, just kidding. Why are we on the moon? Oblivion has claimed him. Is he going to be upset? Emmett Selk, gone. La Habrea, gone. I alone remain. The last of the unbroken. Once more, I am moved to reevaluate the potential of these tattered souls. Elidibus is the last unsundered. Ah, Xenos, never did I dream you could overpower me so completely, possessed as I was in your body, and all its uncanny strength. Dude, what? Xenos' fake Mangeko Sharingan is more power th powerful than him? And now that I have shared with you the truth of this world and its reflections, who can predict how events will unfold? Not I. Emissary. What a poor jest that title has become. The flow of history has become muddy. Its currents wild beyond my capacity to direct them. You have wrestled the advantage, Heidelin. The thieving hands of your disciples tighten their grip on our star. The origins of the world remain hidden and its inhabitants ignorant of their broken existence. The origins of the world remain hidden and its inhabitants ignorant of their broken existence, just as you and your creators desired. They celebrate the gift of imperfect life, uncaring, unknowing, as we weaken and fade. But do not imagine yourself rid of us. Though your champion has indeed proven the most egregious obstacle to our ascendance, a barbed thorn in my side, he may yet be removed and cast into the abyss. Oh yes, it can be done. I will keep those heroes mired in the first and victory will be ours at last. Warriors of darkness now, are they? Then their fate is decided. Huh? They shall meet the same end as those who came before. Death at the hand of the warriors of light. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. It seems you were right. Yes, there is something out there. But it would mean crossing the moms and moms of infernal emptiness, which is rather unhealthy for living creatures, as I understand it. Eden these nuts. Well, well played, chat. Even were we to restrict ourselves to brief forays, I don't like to imagine the effect it would have on our ether. But you still want to go, don't you? We have saved the world, but we haven't reclaimed it. Ah, when you put it that way. Dude, they're bonding. Father and son bonding. It's about time. What choice do we have? Well, of course I'm going with you. That's what family is for, isn't it? 
Come, let's head back and prepare for this mad journey of yours. Thank you. Thank you. Dude, this just keeps going. The fuck is that? That looks like that one mount that people ride around. Through blazing skies give way to gentle night. What hand can end the war of dark and light? You have completed the main scenario quest of Shadowbringers.